Hey there, it's Katia. In today's short, we're going to learn two phrasal verbs, to wind down and wind up. Before we start, just remember that the verb to wind is irregular and it's to wind, wound, wound. Number one, to wind down. It means to relax and rest after being very busy. Two simple sentences. The first one, it's essential to wind down in order to avoid burnout. Two, it's Friday tomorrow. I'm looking forward to winding down. The second phrase verb, to wind up. It means to find yourself in a particular situation or place, especially a negative one. For example, if he keeps driving dangerously, he's gonna wind up hurting someone. And when we're example, I like to save some money every month. I don't want to wind up broke. And in British English, to wind up has another meaning which is to annoy someone. He winds me up when he's not listening to me. Thank you for watching today's shorts. See you next week. Ciao for now.